Men have been the kid. Men have been popped off. And if she ain't trying to get it, then she get dropped off. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for all the love and comment in my last video. If you haven't seen it, I'll leave it down below in the description bar. But thank you for everyone who kind of like really resonated with what I was saying. And yeah man, just thank you guys. Today I'm going to be trying out... Ta -da! This is the X Tammy Revolution palette. It's her Tropical Carnival shadow palette. I really want to try lots of colours this year. The palette is filled with like bright colours that I normally wouldn't go for or kind of like be scared to try. I also have a few other influencers products. Like I have the Jenny Jenkins highlighter, Tisha Bright lipstick, and then I have a bunch of like Patron Cosmetics as well. So I'm going to try and include all of the brands. So basically all the like UK sisters that are like doing bits in the UK industry. I have Jackie Ines foundation as well. I might just slide that one in there as well. Well, but yeah, so without further ado, let's get straight into the video. I'm also going to be talking a bit about this hair later on in the video. So basically, Tammy just uploaded a video. And it's basically a tutorial on how to use her palette. So I feel like I'm going to watch her video and do what she does because I'm not going to lie, you guys, like, I just be trying what I can. Especially with colours, like, I'll be honest, it, it kind of does, like, I do get scared and I don't really know what I'm doing. So I kind of just, like, freehand it. But I'm going to actually follow what Tammy says we should do and do it the right way. And I'm going to talk you through easy ways to wear colours. I know I'm not talking about on your lower lash line. I mean colours and also how to know what colours to put together and what colours blend free of colour like it's just makeup it washes off mm -hmm. and I've heard people say like oh people look at me when I'm wearing colourful eyeshadows people think like oh my god like who cares who cares who cares what people think Ooh, about say that again for the chickens in the back she said it's not about what people think it's just about how you feel you only live once and you don't need to be worrying about what everyone else thinks if you want to wear a green a purple a pink a yellow then go ahead and wear it and wear it with confidence okay so that. don't worry about what people think step number one tip number one uh, check. i really feel like the colors that i want to go for is like blue and orange just because like it matches with the headband that i'm wearing and i think it'll be cute the one thing i would say not to do um unless you're very very skilled at makeup is to blend like an orange and a blue together or a yellow and a purple together because they will turn muddy so just stick to the red i really feel like the colors that i want to go for is like blue and orange oh well maybe not i guess oh i'll have been my business i just bring you guys really really close just because i feel like you guys can see a little bit better and tanya's basically just gone in with a prime mask so i'm gonna use um, the prime lock and loaded by makeup revolution pat this on no swiping no blending yet just patting so we get an even layer of that color can i just say Look how pigmented my palette is. I'm just saying. Yes, girl, tuck your ish. Be proud of your ish. We just clean off the brush if you do have too much pigment on your brush. Girl, you better tuck your ish. You better be proud of your ish. You better. <laughs> if I had a product, what? You look, you think you can shut me up? I will go on and on about it. Yes, I love this colour, but on Tammy it looks red, but on me it looks purple. Ooh, I'm using colour. <laughs> Got an even layer of that packed on. I gently, gently not pressing, and I also hold the brush towards the end of the handle so I don't get too much pressure. Gently diffuse the edges of that red that I laid down. Red? Just so we don't have a harsh line. So just gently blending. Oh, I think she put red somewhere. Oh my god, I think I missed a step. Girl. That's why it looks so red. I'm so sincere. I obviously did something wrong. I thought you took purple and you clearly didn't. Do you know what? Let's see if I can cover the purple back up with red. I'll matte yellow and I'm going to start by pressing this onto the inner corner and then carrying it up above by the brow bone. Hey guys, so we got this. We got this and I actually like it. Now Tammy's used the red one, the red shimmer one in her palette, but I feel like I'm, I'm loving this colour. It's like a copper colour. What's this colour called? This colour is called Notting Hill. So basically, I watched her video that she did like reviewing um, the name and like all these names are like named after different carnivals. So you got Calypso. Just to like say a few 
see. You got Calypso, you got Spice Rum, a short knee, which I think she was saying short knees like some people that dress up in carnival. They wear like bright colored, and I don't know if they were sh they're normally short, but yeah, don't 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 quote me. But she said something about people who come to carnival all colored up, dressed up. You got Trini, Trinidad girl, them my pack, them my wine up there. Yes, and pack. You got Navy for bad girl Riri. She put um girlies because that's what Tammy calls her subscribers. You got Jabba Jabba. You got Soka. Yeah, basically you got a whole lot of a whole lot of Caribbean names in this and I proper love that. But yeah, so she used the red, but I think I'm gonna go in with like the copper and maybe mix it into the red. I'm gonna cut my crease again with the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define this time. I'm proud of myself. Yes, honey, I cut that. Look at that. Isn't it? I cut that. Let me zoom in for y'all. Oh, she cut that. I can't look. You know when you don't want to look up? I don't want to look up. I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want the crease to move. Now that the concealer's kind of dry, I'm going to go in with the shade Not In Hill. And my Tink Semi's also going to use Spice Serum. Because Tammy's using Spice Serum. It looks really cute. Oh, I love that. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to go ahead and do my other eye off camera. And then come back and finish the rest of my face. Okay, guys. I don't really know what happened with this eye. We're just going to, like not really look at it too long i'm literally just watching tootsie time's video and she's basically talking about like giving up and like the status quo of like you know when you hit this certain age you need to like stop and think about you know trying something different rap man if you guys know then you know i love rap man just like everything he stands for everything he's done and accomplished and like if you don't know who he is he's a producer a label owner now he's got so much names under his belt but he's known for writing shiro's story in his interview he basically was talking about um how he said to himself this is the last year he's gonna do anything after this he's got children he needs to focus on you know taking care of his family and getting like a proper job or whatever and like this was the last year he's gonna do any of this stuff so can you imagine like this was the last year this year being 2018 that he said he was gonna do any of this stuff and then this is the year that jay-z came across his video on youtube said who is this guy i want to sign him in fact i don't want to sign him i want to make him a manager no in fact i don't want to make him a manager i want to make him a partner he can sign people he can create his own tv show he can create like legit i cape for this guy like people always say that like is he your brother or something but i just feel like i proper love his story because he comes from the same area that i come from we grew up in the same area and also because like i can relate to feeling like wanting to give up sometimes and mean like you know what let me just go and do something let me just go do something else that you know is a bit more what's the word sustainable or like guaranteed but then it's like no i swear to god like you only have one life you only have one life to live and it's like unless you believe in reincarnation i don't know but you literally only have one life so it's like no, I don't care like if I fail I'm gonna try again if I fail I'm gonna try again if I fail I'm gonna try again guess what I only have one life and I can't I can't that being said I'm not crazy now like I will never just like give up on like I'll never give up on like my nine to five or something that's like giving me a check consistently unless I have a secure plan unless I get a big deal that means I'm gonna be sustained or okay for the next six months or 12 months and again like having rainy day fun having savings like boy i was so bad with savings until i started like this whole youtube stuff because it's like again you don't know one day one month you could be paid a lot of money the next month you could be paid absolutely nothing so well for small youtube like for small youtubers like me that's just how it goes i would never just give up without having like i'm gonna be good for a period but at the same time Chase your dreams, baby girl and baby boys, because you only have one life. Like, you legit only have one life. You might as well live it to the fullest. Oh, Tammy got my eyes looking real cute. Okay, I don't really know what happened with this eye, but we gonna just move on and act like that didn't happen. The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with foundation. I already have foundation on my forehead. Lucky Islanders Too Faced foundation. Chestnut is like my go-to. So I'm gonna use chestnut. And I'm gonna mix that in with my mix that in with my moisturizer. This is the B Sunshine Vitamin C shot. Oh, the sun's coming out! <laughs> Matches my eyes. Come on, sun, come on. Um, I'm gonna mix this with my vitamin C and just like cover my face. Next, I'm going to go in with these Born This Way concealers. I use the shade Warm Sand, Toffee and Chestnut. To prove anyone wrong, if they don't think you're going to make it, fine. That's their negative energy that you don't need in your life. But why do you care? Why do you care about 
care so bad that you want to make it your mission to prove them wrong. You're not doing it for them. Don't ever do it for them. Do it for yourself. Literally went off camera. I hate a bit of food, I'm not gonna lie. And I baked and highlighted and all that jazz. So, so now I'm gonna move on. I'm going in with this My Lottie London bronzer just to like add some redness back into my face. The okay, next thing I'm gonna go in with is the Black Up Jenny Jenkins highlighter palette. She created this palette, I think, last year. The two bottom shades, they look quite dark. <laughs> And then I also left the corners of my eyes because I wanted to use this on the corners of my eyes as well. Ooh. Wow, this is, oh, that's pretty. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the Patricia Wright MAC lipstick. I'm not gonna lie, I've used this a lot, so it's a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and just put that on. I also wanna use a purple. It's the color 028 lilac. I think it will look cute. Oh, the sun is coming out and I'm feeling cute. <laughs> okay guys, so this, oh, I'm gonna sit right here in front of the sun so y'all can see it properly. Here's the finished look. I did add the gosh purple to on top of the Patricia Bright lipstick just because I feel like the purple, it all looks cute. But yeah, this is the finished look. I proper like it. I do really, really like how it turned out. It is something like completely different. I'm gonna zoom in to show you guys that I look properly. But this is the colors that I'm working with. I did go on and pop these Patron cosmetic lashes on. I don't know the ones that I put on. This is Goddess, so I think the ones that I'm wearing now but you know that when you take lashes out of the box and you can't remember which one you have but it's either goddess or candid one of them i have a discount code as well mimi you get some money off and also you get money off this necklace as well that i'm wearing this necklace is from kayoni and that's also lizzie love's brand as well lizzie love and her partner and you can get 10 percent off people always ask me where did i get this chain from but it's from Kayoni. Kayoni, I hope I'm saying it right, on Instagram. There's this brand on Instagram who sent me like a bunch of headbands and I've been rocking them. So if you guys are interested in where I got them, I will also leave her Instagram page here. Um, another amazing, beautiful chocolate girl starting, um, I, think, I think it is her business. But um, yeah, I'll leave that here as well. Big up all the girls who were blessed with the opportunity to be able to collab with a brand and shout out my girl Tammy on her second edition of her palette. Tammy is someone who like says she wants to do something and then does it because I remember when she first gave me her other palette, she told me she wants to do a second palette and she wanted it to be like all multi-coloured. Like she actually said this and this was like a year ago and now we here we're gonna talk about it, be about it. She did that. If it's your first time here, make sure you subscribe and turn on your notifications because YouTube be acting up. Um, so you guys turn on your notifications. If there is any more UK girl dems doing bits or even man them doing bits, make sure you comment them down below and start like the community talking. Let's support the people that we need to support and yeah man, love this makeup. This hair is from Wow Wigs. I love Wow Wigs. They do straight hair, body wave hair. Amina had this hair, a wig from them, and it just looked amazing. Wow Wigs hair is sick. The packaging is sick. This hair I did actually cut. I quickly, just to show you how I style it. So I kind of always wear it like with these African headbands because I really like the way it looks. But I literally just get a bottle filled with water. Spray it down, spray it down. One thing that I do as well is I do like to brush it. And I know people are like, oh, don't brush curly hair. I really do like to brush it, especially if it's good quality hair. And that's pretty much me. What I love about this hair is that it's so light. It's light and it's not that thin. It's light and it's not thin. So the hair doesn't feel heavy. I don't feel like I'm even wearing a wig more. Especially when it's up in a bun, I really don't even feel like I'm wearing a wig. It just feels really light. And again, I do really like the hair. I've never tried any hair from there before. I don't know if they're like a new brand, but the packaging is A1. The wigs that they have on their websites looks really good as well. So I'll leave all their details down below in the description bar. If y'all wanna get you some curly hair, Again, if you want more details, again, if you want more details on this hair, all the information will be listed down below in the description bar. Anyways, guys, let me go and I'll speak to you guys in another video.